had these uh, I've had these lamb shanks warming up the room temperature and got um, salt pepper some secret herbs in there oh, it's better to uh, cover the lamb and flour cover that in the flour the flour helps to brown these up but also it'll thicken the stock Salt and herb pepper mix. Get it nicely coated. Make a nice mess everywhere in the kitchen. Hot pot. Slow cooker's already warming up. Just on preheat. Get these nicely browned up. I've already uh, pre chopped my carrot and onion. A little bit of garlic to pop in there. The girls, yeah. And I just like chucking it just for fun. A couple of uh, shallots. Put a good can opener out for the diced tomatoes. And I've got some parsley and some rosemary. I would like some thyme, but I've got some rosemary because that's what I'm growing at the moment. And I'll do some mashed potatoes. Maybe even chuck in some uh, silver beet from the garden. And not sure what else I have it with yet. Pop those into the slow cooker. I don't even know how to use this. Oh. Diane, do you know how to use the slow cooker? Brown up the veggies. Of old coke lying around, red wine, salt in there, and a lot of stock. A little stock in there as well. Straight away, the smell just goes right through the whole kitchen. Thing down a bit. Same pan and just wipe it out because I don't want any of those meat, um, braised meat flavours going through into the vegetables. Just wipe that out. Sometimes it can blacken. Bit of a tip of chopping the onions, to keep them in the fridge for a couple of hours before you cut them up. It seems to help stop me crying. I'm, I'm a real crybaby with onions, so keep them in the fridge for a couple of hours before you use them. Makes a good difference. Veggies down and the wine and stock. This helps to speed up the cooking process. I'm going to check a little bit of flour in there. I can pick it up a little bit. Add in the tomatoes. Right, let's chuck the tomatoes in there. I like to keep it simple. Put that down a bit. She's a great winter dish. Love a cold winter's day. Working up a feed of lamb shanks. Nothing better. This makes the whole house smell just like yum. We'll uh, throw our veggies in. They're up to temperature. Just have to, have to, have to get them up to temperature. You don't really cook them. My little lamb shanks are in there cooking away. Oh, I can see that. Oh, 
Might need my other hand to get the rest in. It's a bit dry. Okay, that's looking good. Time to uh, chuck the lid on and uh, let the slow cooker do its magic. Oh no, whoa! I missed that important step. I'm going to put my herbs, my parsley, and um, our rosemary just in there on the top. And we'll just give it that yummy slow cooker flavour. Herbalicious flavour. A lot of people tie those up, tie that up with a bit of kitchen string, but uh, I don't have any. And there we have it. We'll see how she turns out. Now I better get peeling some potatoes. Better start peeling some potatoes. Get onto that yummy silver bead as well. Yum yum, all dashed up. Diane can't help herself. She's already getting into it.